All right, y'all, it's week two of the Texas high school football season, and I have arrived in Anderson County, Cayuga, as the Cayuga Wildcats will take on the Mildred Eagles in a rare small school Thursday night matchup uh, scheduled here due to the referee shortage uh, in the Tyler chapter. So I made a drive out to uh, near East Texas here, and I'm going to watch uh, Mildred and Cayuga battle it out on Thursday night to start the Texas high school football week two weekend. Let's do it. Thursday night, week two, DCTF watch along, Fort Bend, Ridge Point, and Dickinson, and your girls got the goods. I'm in the Scarborough Stadium here in Cayuga. I don't know, I feel like it's a waste that this isn't fired up right now. Such a shame. Live from the watch along. Quarterback's going to keep it. Trying to go on the right side of his offensive line. <laughs> My oh oh bird. Oh, there he goes. Go bird. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, get the gas. Oh, 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 oh. Bird Emanuel says, "See ya." That's a rock out punch. Bears offense. Committed to Texas A&M. All right, y'all, it's the second Friday night of the high school football season, and I have just arrived at the former Globe Life Park, now known as Choctaw Stadium, for the Hebron Hawks versus the Martin Warriors in a DFW 6A matchup. So we're going to head into the stadium, see what's going on, and get ready for some Friday night lights. On the middle of 35, stuck in traffic. Any guesses where I'm at? Correct. Waco, Texas, baby. One million, zillion, jillion, billion, cotillion times later. Update. Still in Waco traffic. I am very hungry. I have no food. I might have to eat my left arm. You think they're gonna let me in? We'll see. Gonna give us a little look of how a high school football field now fits into a former baseball stadium. We made it to Austin. We went on a little hike. There's Marcus getting everything set up and uh, this is where we ended up. Not too bad. All right team, <laughs> we just hiked up to the 360 over sight thing and boy howdy, BB ready, huh? <laughs> it's headed to the Westlake game. And there's a rainbow in the sky. And a Lambo, but mainly a rainbow. View here from the booth. We're about an hour away from kickoff. And uh, here's what we all work with. Headset, computer, and uh, of course, most important thing, binoculars to see. Let's go. Football Friday, powered by Dave Campbell's Texas Football. And, and we are already off our rocker. Uh, Aaron literally just Woo! called me Greg Pepper on the air. At least, caveat, at least I didn't call you Greg Salt and Pepper as when we were in 2014. Check it out on YouTube, kids. Off to a good start. Jackson out of the gun. Keyshawn moving in the backfield with him. Four receivers set, three up top, one at the bottom of your screen. He made it in the vlog last week. And he's back again. It's everyone's favorite, Guy Frazier. Guy, how was the first half? Um, I kind of what we feared, right? Uh, it's turned into a little bit of a dog. Ollie Gordon's frustrated, and Clay, you know, uh, Bluebeck's kind of made it his game and taken over here. So hopefully it's a little more competitive in the, in the second half, but uh, I fear it may not be. 
27 nothing. not looking good for Trinity so far, but regardless, Guy made the vlog, so we're all good here. About a formerly Globe Life Park, now Choctaw Stadium, after Arlington Martin rolls Hebron 59 to 15. Big win for the Warriors. Now we're gonna try to find some post-game meal and then get ready for tomorrow morning when I uh, hit the airport. So let's see what we're gonna do tomorrow for Cy Park and Cy Fair. Y'all, it's Saturday morning. I got my breakfast tacos, my fuel, I'm ready to go. I'm headed to the airport while TV stars like Greg Tepper are sleeping in on Saturday. Your, your friend, your pal, your high school football hero, Matt Stepp, is headed to the airport for a little Houston area high school football. Hashtag blessed. Some of my most productive work is done while sitting in the airport. As you can see, I'm working on Player of the Week nominations, and we got my state rankings information right here as well for the coming week. Putting scores in, trying to figure out where teams are going to be ranked. And I'm also working on Coach of the Week nominations. Look at that. So lots of productive work going on in the airport. All right, we're about to head out. Go to H-Town, one of the best places to go get a piece of pizza near the airport is Spanky's Pizza. Shout out Marcus Gutierrez for the recommendation. Start out some cheesy breadsticks to get going. The key to ordering pizza is order a lot of pizza, that way you can take some back to the hotel with you and have dinner or a late night snack. Boom. Got us a little meat lovers action here at Spanky's. All right, we are here for our my first ever color broadcasting. I should done my first time, but it's the first time in a while. My man Gavin Moritz has got it all set up. He's already set everything up for me, taking good care of me because Lord knows I need all the help I can get. Shout out Ashley Pickle just because she's awesome. Is that right, Gavin? Yep. And off here on the carry, Cameron King trying to find a lane to the outside. King cuts it back up the middle. Cameron King looking for touchdown number four. Touchdown, Cy Park. Cameron King wants all the deli meats and cheeses. All <laughs> of it. He is having himself an evening. All right, y'all. I'm in my hotel room. Saturday night in Houston, and it's another week of Texas high school football in the books. The Cy Park Tigers make a statement. 62-28 win over Cy Fair. And I'll tell you what, Cy Park, team to keep an eye on District 16-6A. They're going to be a problem. And I had a great time on the Texan Live broadcast. It was a great weekend. Gavin, Gavin Moritz is a heck of a play-by-play -play guy. And uh, hopefully I didn't make him look too bad because it was a fun broadcast. So uh, it's a great week of Texas high school football. And we got a bunch more to go at Dave Campbell's Texas football. Flight back to Dallas. Exit row victory. Let's do this. Look at all that red room for activities. Hey, thanks for watching this clip here on YouTube. If you like this kind of stuff and you want more of it, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. And remember, you can watch us live every weekday at noon at texasfootball.com, Facebook, Twitch, or here on YouTube. And if you want more of the best coverage of football in the state of Texas, check out texasfootball.com and become a Dave Campbell's Texas Football Insider at texasfootball.com slash subscribe.